A native of Quebec City, Patrice Denis arrived at Western in 1993 via the Champlain Cougars program. Western linebacker coach Chris Marcus testified that Denis was a special player from day one. The first time I put him through a set of drills, I can see that he had the level and the talent to be a perennial all-star in the OHA. Denis would go on to fulfill Marcus' prediction. Leading the team in tackles as a rookie, he was honored as a second team OUA all-star and would go on to start every game in his Mustang career. Denis' sophomore year would be special. On a personal level, he achieved first team OUA all-star status and from a team perspective, the 1994 Western Mustang came together to produce one of the most inspiring, gut-wrenching, amazing seasons in the history of Mustang football. Completing a perfect year, the Mustangs collected the Yates, Churchill, and Banyer titles with a perfect 12-0 record. Known as Mr. Intensity, Denis was a critical component in leading the defense through this magical season. Standing 6'2", at 230 pounds, Patrice covered 40 yards in 4.6 seconds and could bench press 400 pounds. Larry Hiller said of Denis, his quickness and lateral ability, together with his striking skills, made him one of the best at his position in the nation. In the open field, there was none better than Patrice, who could make the one-on-one -on -one tackle in space against the best the opponents had to offer. The 1995 season witnessed Denis harnessing all his talents, helping the team win the Yates Cup, an Atlantic Bowl, and a second consecutive berth in the national championship. Denis was voted the best defensive player in the OUA and named a first-team All-Canadian at linebacker. Possessing great pass rush skills, his quickness and anticipation was equally effective versus the pass or the run. Off the field, Coach Haler said, Denis puts in the work, does the things people don't see, but are completely necessary to do what they're trying to do. As a result, Denis was voted team captain of the 1996 team. Upon hearing the results of the vote, Denis said, that makes me feel so proud. I want everything that goes with being team captain. I want to set the standard for intensity. His senior year was filled with accolades, honored as a second team All-Canadian, he was also awarded the Darwin Simodiak Trophy as the team's best student athlete and presented with a prestigious purple blanket given to Western athletes who achieved superior distinction at the national level as a representative of the university. The CFL soon came calling as the Edmonton Eskimos chose Patrice in the second round of the 1997 entry draft with the 16th overall pick. Upon hearing of the selection to the powerhouse Eskimos, Denis was elated, saying, this is great news. I wanted to go to a winner because I'm so used to winning at Western. Denis would play with the Eskimos from 1997 to 1999, playing in over 50 games. He registered 60 tackles, one reception for 26 yards, two fumbled recoveries, one blocked punt, and two sacks. At the conclusion of his football career, Denis would put his honors actuarial studies degree into action in the investment world, becoming a successful executive vice president for a large global investment firm. Football stayed close to his heart. He coached the University of Montreal Caravan in their inaugural season in 2002, and he presently coaches his son's football team in the Lakeshore football program. With his playing days over, his passion for training is still alive with a focus on triathlon competitions. He's a four-time Ironman finisher. His former head coach, Haler, reminisced about Denis, saying, Patrice possessed great character, a courage to compete, and capacity to be at his best within the good and the bad moments of the game. An exceptional player, person, and teammate, Patrice left a legacy at Western for all to emulate. Patrice Denis, a Mustang legend.